Pride of the Irish roars into a New York welcome aboard the liner Manhattan. And down Broadway, the Pride of the Irish is buried beneath a mountain of waste paper. On the steps of the City Hall, we're introducing Douglas Corrigan. Uh, I just hope that if I make any more mistakes, they'll turn out as successful as this one. <laughs> <laughs> Say, Mr. Corrigan, how about those girlfriends? Well, there ain't any girlfriends, even though the papers and all the photographers, they sort of ring in a few of them once in a while, but that's all made up just like most of the other stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Say, Douglas, were the Irish girls interested in you? Oh, there weren't so very many of them over there, and I haven't seen very many since I got back either. There was a few on the boat, but they didn't bother you, you know. They were the tame kind. <laughs>